Right guys, welcome back to the channel. It is seven o'clock in the morning and it is freezing. The ground is soft. Good conditions for detecting. So, let's do it. Let's see what we can find today. Hopefully something good. I'm on my own. Um, excited for next week because I've got a dig. I'm actually going on my own. None of the boys can make it, but I thought, sod it, I'm going on my own. So yeah, looking forward to that. Um, up in Onga way. So yeah, uh, should be a good video. Hopefully some really good finds. But I'm out with a mine lab again. Uh, so yeah, let's see what we can find. See you on the first decent find. Right, first up is a button. Don't you just hate it when these come up, guys. You think you're on the silver and then you turn it over. Boom. Shank. Yeah, just a button. Uh, all I've done is walk to that bit, as you can see. But this ground is so, look. It's so boggy, it's quite hard to find the target. But yeah, moving on. Right guys, coming in at 87, quite deep. Yes, look at that. It's a drawer handle, but that is nice. You can tell it's a drawer handle. When I first saw it, I thought, oh my God, what is this? So I give it a clean. Look at that. This seems to be the area, if you look at my previous videos, that I found a couple more fancy drawer handles. So it seems a bit odd, I don't know what went on here, you know, dumping furniture, could be. But yeah, that is nice, I like that. That goes with me others. I'll give that a really good clean, because you can see some goldish tint to it. But yeah, that might come up really well. It is just absolutely poor, Dan. This cloud came over. I was on the phone to my wife. I said, oh, I've got to go find shelter. And it chucked it down. But I luckily got under like a bushy area, a tree, and got away from it. And it actually passed. Thank God for that. But yeah, all right, let's get on. All right, next up, coming in at 47, is a belt buckle. Still got a bit of leather on it, so might not be too old, but just had that bit, sort of drawer handle there. Here comes the rain again. Oh God. But yeah, right, see you on the next. Right, coming in at about, well, it was quite jumpy actually, 47 to 50 to 54, but it seems, it looks like a crotal bell. And it is a full one, but missing the handle, which I am gutted. Let's just give it, that's what's good about the wet grass. You can wash your finds. Bear with me. Bear with me. Right. Here we go. Yeah, crotal bell. <laughs> what a shame the handle's gone. So it would have been back there. Full one and all. Look at that. Oh well, happy with that. Quite deep, but look at my holes guys, they're just filling it up with water. So you've really got to get to it quick. But yeah, crotal bell. Right, see you on the next. Right, coming in at about 67. Lead, it's got a hole for it. I could be wrong, I probably am. But is it like a spindle wheel or something like that? I know these can date back quite early and being right next to that Roman path just in the forest bit there runs across some of these can go back as far as then but I'm probably wrong so just put in the comments what these are because uh, I find quite a few of these so yeah yeah 67 on the mine lab let's carry on all right guys coming in at 57 look at this for a buckle Hey, eh? look at the size of that. That is huge. I don't know what that would have been off of, but that is quite big. That is the biggest one I've ever had. Let's just put this back. So boggy. Look at that. Still got the massive pin. It's got to be off a horse or something. But look at that. I'm happy with that. 
that'll go in the buckle collection but I don't think it will fit in my box give that a good clean when I get home impressed with that as I say only 57 but it was a lovely clear signal about five or six inches down so the mine lab does so well but yeah all right let's crack on see what else we can get right banging signal coming in at about 57 no 57 to 60 something but look at that beast that's about three that have come up now justin last week had a full one really nice condition i had one the other day but it was a bad day that's all i really found so i couldn't get a video out but yeah so we both got a full one and that is just missing the tip but that'll clean up nice but it's not broken or anything a little bit bent there but but yeah 50 calibre size of that all right let's carry on all right coming in at 77 whatever that is sharp because i need to cut my finger on that getting out of the hole i don't wear gloves i know i should but because of the filming it's just i've got to take them off and then put them back on it's just yeah frustrating but yeah that nearly done me but yeah just found that 50 caliber just there and now that's just popped up it's amazing because you can detect in a certain area and there'd be nothing and then you just find a lovely hot spot where random stuff comes up but yeah if anyone knows what that would have been off please let me know but yeah that's one for the box finds box at home all right let's carry on right coming in at 57 is this what's this took me a while to find as you can see but look, it's still got the pin you know it, i don't know if it's military cat badge but nah i can't see it being that but it might be sort of late victorian a hair clip or you know something like that i'll have to give this a really good clean but it's got dry area so I'm in the next field, just walked across there. So if I get any uh, puddle anywhere or waterlogged area, I'll give it a good clean. But yeah, look at that. That is nice. I love finding things like this. There you go. Let's carry on. Right, this took ages to find. It was a really naff signal, but it's just a musket ball, but it just shows it was a naff yeah, look how round that is and the signal was just terrible really choky like 64 downwards upwards so yeah it just shows on the mine lab you just got to dig really if you're not sure but yeah perfect round mus musket ball right let's carry on right next up is a key but look at the design on that it's a nice one let me get you in the light yeah look y and t That's the old yell mark. So it's quite an early key there, isn't it? Right. Hopefully it's the key to something major. Right, let's carry on. Well, I was just about to call it a day, but this is the first coin that's just come up. 10p. I'm just doing around this little tree area. It's going to be full of rubbish. But first target, 10p. Right, let's see what else we can find. Oh, nah, no coins, guys, nothing. I'm going to call it a day now and look forward to the dig next Sunday. So, thanks for joining me and uh, let's hope there's better luck next week when I go out. Right, see you later, guys.